talking about marriage arrange marriage love marriage which way is successful which way is not successful today we really cannot judge which way is successful which way is not successful because the both system there is success and there is failure but let me tell you in arranged marriage there is much success from my perspective from my personal experience i can tell you i am a successful man my wife is successful because we learn to love each other after marriage if i go into a little bit detail it's going to be hilarious uh, in the western world to understand how i got married you may not understand what i'm trying to say now actually i didn't meet my wife till i was married it was an arranged marriage i was in this country united states studying and it was at that time uh, my parents they through a friend uh, came to know my wife's family and my father went to their home my mother went along with my father and saw this girl and they thought this person would be the right choice for my son and uh, they called me and they said son we have found a girl for you and at the same time they didn't impose it on me they gave me a choice they said if you have anybody in mind if you have anyone whom you want to get married let us know uh, but i tell you i grew up in such a manner that i never had anyone that i was going to get married to because there were some thoughts that came in my mind there were some plans that i had but it really didn't work out and i was more concentrating in my studies then and my choices were not really uh, the right choices so i depended on my parents and when they brought up this alliance for me i said i i will pray about it and i'll accept this alliance so when i went to india they took me to her house to elsa my wife so when i first went i met her and they let me speak to her for a few minutes and i spoke to her then they asked me do you love her i don't know what to answer because we just met for a brief period of time and there's no question of love or hate you don't know there's no relationship but i trusted god trusted my parents and agreed to that marriage but later we got married and after married after marriage we learned to love each other we travel together and today i can tell you we are successful we are really happy and we have a wonderful life and she understands me i understand her and there is no conflict and we are growing so i would suggest that when it comes time for you to marry wait on the lord just don't get into anything immediately emotionally because that's not love it can be emotion sometimes our lust we don't know the difference between lust and love we get confused so based on lust you get engaged and you get married then you end up in conflict problem struggles in life but you first judge whether you're in lust or you're in love if you're in love you got to understand the qualities of love love bears all things love is patient love is self controlled love endures love protects so when you have all those nature then it's love so you judge love and lust and if you're in lust and if you're in l- thinking that you're going to marry that person because of this lust relationship that's going to be disastrous in your life but if you're in love that's fine trust god and he will help you